What's, What's up, everybody? everybody? I'm Bells, and, I'm Mel. and today we're going to be continuing rewatching, coming back to Mushiko Tensei. We're going to be doing episode nine and ten. Um, yeah, uh, the the thing about this anime, we dropped it. What was it? A year and a half ago? Twenty twenty one. Yeah, it was a while ago. We, we dropped this anime. So it's been um, over a year. It's been over a year. And, um, you know, we're coming back to this anime because we want to give it another chance. We want to give it another chance. A lot of people have been, um, you know, still recommending this anime to us, still telling us we should go back. And, um, I, you know, I don't know. You know, this anime, is, it just seems really, really, really popular. And um, a lot of people say that this anime is, is the best isekai, you know, of all time and um i just felt like maybe it's time to like you know give it another chance give it another chance and see exactly what the hype is about because after we watched um what was it episode eight is when mm -hmm. the, the, yeah the, the, our the, last episode was episode eight yeah like um you know if you guys know you guys know if you know you know episode eight you know had a lot of um well had a specific disturbing scene and you know there's a lot of disturbing scenes in this anime i think it was that was one in episode five as well but um the main character is not a uh, main character that um i want to support that um i envision supporting you know and rooting for in a series and i think that was the main issue we've had we had with this anime and um i don't know a lot of people have said that this anime you know he changes and that he becomes a better person and you know and you'll grow to like him look guys i'm gonna be honest with you guys i don't think i don't think there's any redeemable qualities in a character like um rudy but we will give this another chance we will give this another chance and i feel like there's probably something missing here because we don't have the full information that you guys do because a lot of you guys you know you guys read the novel you got you guys um you know have a better understanding of um the character himself so I will trust you guys. We're going to keep, you know, we're going to give this another chance. We're going to give this another go. And I want to basically take all the information in. I want to take all the information in of, you know, of the whole series, the whole show, because, you know, Rudy is not the whole show. He is the main character because he is a big part of the show because he's the main character. But um, there are other aspects that are probably enjoyable in this anime, right? So we're going to go ahead and give this another chance. Um, people did say that um, you guys stopped at like the the worst possible episode because this is when things are going to change you know mm. people were like people were like oh no you guys should have because i remember when we watched episode eight it was uh it was just us you know we just did one episode we just did that because we were doing like one two three four five two episodes at a time and for some reason it was people telling us to just do episode eight too and then whatever i guess but people were upset that we just watched episode eight and didn't continue to nine because that's when for them they really got hooked to the series right mm -hmm. and i'm not saying the series was really i'm not gonna lie what we saw with mushiko tensei like the animation the fights the the, the, the overall story developing it was some awesome stuff like if you like isekai there was some awesome stuff building here but it's just rudy just left a sour taste in our mind we were like yo we just we just can't do with this character but um yeah we stopped at episode eight we probably should have continued to nine but um, yeah, we're gonna continue now. It's a year and a half in the I'm making. Basically, two years. Basically, two years, and you know, we weren't playing, man. When when we dropped this thing, we were like, "Yo, we gone. Like, we're not coming back to this." And we actually came back because um, you know, I I guess I wanna. I just wanna. If the thing <laughs> is, I don't think I just wanna get the whole information because I just don't understand how everybody's saying this is the best isekai ever when you have a main character like this. But we're gonna continue it. We're going to see what the hype's about. We're going to see, you know, what everybody's, you know, raving about this series. And um, I'm going to see and see if if I personally can get over. Um, Imagine if we drop it for the second time. Man, that would that would that would suck. That would suck. But no, we, we're going to give it another chance. It would suck because you guys won't be yeah. happy. Yeah. And you know, the problem because we've seen different elements like this in anime before. But I don't think we've ever seen a main character behave like Rudy. That's what... That's what is just so, man. We're just gonna go yes, in. We're gonna let it drop it, and um, we're gonna start with episode nine. And here we go. Uh oh, this is the real Rudy. Huh? We see the real Rudy. Mm. So yeah, 
The hell is this? Really? はあ。肉体は無事だ。なら。うん。目が覚めても死んじゃうよ。that's it so he's he's the man god interesting mm. i gotta say that's one thing about this anime it's really well produced like everything about this anime like the visuals the direction is like very very well produced Oh, is that the man? Yes, the man. Wait. Why is there a man? Oh, they fell from the sky. ここはどこですか。また入り区の北東、ビエゴヤ地方。うん。随分と遠いところに来てしまいました。スペルだ、スペルだ、バカ。ひれ、ねえ、通ってきてくれないのよ。止めなさい、レディオス、止めなさい。
こんにちは。マジングを勉強しておいてよかった。オサのロックスです。おその首飾り、どこで手に入れなさった名前はロキシー。Mm -hmm. ロキシーああ、で、マイビーレレレツロキシー。スエンケザニロキシー。ロキシー。His daughter. Oh, his daughter. Oh, wow. Oh, he looks like he's the same age as her. Yeah, he looks、heck? so young. This is her so, hometown. Ah, okay. He made it to Roxy's hometown. <laughs> he's not saying a word. Oh. Are all the girls named Roxy? Uh, I don't know. Mm. I guess、wow. he's just saying they look like Roxy.、Oh. oh, so that's why he looks so young. Man, that language is so. Father in law? <laughs> that language, like, you know, when they're speaking, it's such a different. Because they're not speaking, um, like they're speaking a different language、mm -hmm. in this area. The, they call it the demon something? Was it demon something? I, I, don't, I don't remember. It sounds like House of the Dragons when the Targaryen are speaking the, the、yeah. Targaryen language. But you can't enter cities. Huh. He wants to remove that reputation they have. Laplace's scheme? Who's Laplace? ラプラス。やつは俺たち裏切った。俺たちはいつからか敵味方関係なく周囲の者たちを襲い出すようになったのだ。だが誰も疑問に思わなかった。殺すようになった。Seems like they were brainwashed. And remember that God said to protect,、um, the, stay with that man and protect him.、Mm. Hundred and two. Yeah, because it's been twenty years since Roxy last came to her hometown. <laughs> He <No> . said no. Hehehehe. But Yube, I was convinced by what I saw. At that time, that conversation was asked. Oh, she's out here. She's gonna be the one with the sword. Mm-hmm. 町の外では守ってもらい、中では助ける。A chance encounter.、Mm. Yep. All right, let's see.、Um, let's make sure there's nothing back here. First episode back. Let's see here. Yeah, I don't think there's going to be anything. All right.、Um, yeah, first episode back.、Um, good episode. Nothing, you know, where we learned about this new guy,、um, Ruj, how do you pronounce that? Rujad? Rujad?、Um, I don't know how to pronounce it. Okay. His name.、Um, this, is it Ru, Rujad? Rujad. Rujad. Yeah, Rujad. So, yeah, so they met this new guy, this、um, Rujad guy. It, it is kind of like, because,、um, you know, we, we went from like the old world to this、yes. world. Like, like, it kind of happened in the blink of an eye, even though for us, <laughs> for us, it happened in two years. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, but it does seem like this guy's trying to repair his, um, you know, the, his clan's image, and, um, you know, maybe Rudy and them help him 
do that. And then that, what's interesting, the beginning of this episode, how he's, you know, he's Rudy was speaking to like um the god or whatever, the, mm-hmm. the man god. Yeah, that man is god. a very interesting concept in this anime. That um, um, I think that's the first time we've ever encountered it, um, him. You know, like the yeah, first, I, I don't think we've ever seen that. Yeah, the, we saw before. we saw Rudy um pass away and then he reincarnated, but that was basically it. But seeing that man guy was very interesting to me. So I do want to learn more. Like that, that has me intrigued to learn mm-hmm. more about that. But um, yeah, yeah, I think that probably was one of the most interesting things. Um in this episode mm-hmm. was that man god and there's a dragon god too which is interesting so there's multiple gods it seems yeah like and um you know he was talking to like the old rudy or well, rudy the, sees himself like because as... yeah because he that man god was even saying oh like this is your mind mm-hmm. like that person there this is mind and then he still has like he has a different body mm-hmm. which was Currently. um interesting yeah what do you you mean no just what he was telling him like this is what the man god was the conversation that they had Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah that is the man god thing is very interesting i I do want to learn more about that and the dragon god as well but um and he did say to make sure you stay with this guy because this guy is important not only to it's going to be important to Rudy, but this guy seems to be important to whatever plan this man god has as well Mm -hmm. but yeah I also wonder why Roxy hasn't been back to her hometown. Like, I wonder. Well, it's in another realm, so maybe she's just yeah, living. But yeah, in a... but twenty years is a long time. Like, I wonder because, mm-hmm. like, the way that the parents reacted was like, "Yeah, we haven't seen her in so long." Like, well, maybe they're, you know, they're falling if... out. Yeah, and I, and whatever that reason is, I would like to know if it's like meaningful mm-hmm. enough. Mm-hmm. You know, for sure. But yeah, let's go and jump in the next episode. Let's go check it out. Let's go. Oh damn! What the hell? Oh man. She's slashing. Man, she's just messing up those dogs or whatever they are. Wolves. Weird wolf dogs. Wolf demons. Hogs. Hmm. Oh, and they're eating them too. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. That looks disturbing. <laughs> I want to eat beef. <laughs> Rice and beef. That's one thing about this anime. It's really well. The the art looks amazing. The animation is great. Like the production in this anime is just top notch. So it is kind of like the demon language. This this weird language thing. He kind of looks like Beerus. Nah, don't disrespect Beerus like that. What? <laughs> nah, that guy looks weird. Does, he does. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. They literally didn't even. What did he do? Did he probably he probably painted the the red thing on his head so that they didn't see it. I like this OST. Yeah, me too. (laughs) I'm running out of money. Mm -hmm. Adventurers. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, they his hair as well. He changed his whole look. Right. Oh gosh, okay. look at Rudy's hair. <laughs> changed his whole look. Okay. So the the red thing is still there. Still visible. But it's just his hair. They're not even taking them serious. Nope. Yo, just because his hair is different, mm-hmm. they don't think it's him. Yo, mm-hmm. these guys are so... What's the word? Gullible? It, yeah, it, not gullible, but... what? Yeah, like they're just... What's that? I'm, not, I'm trying to think of the word. Yo, that's... <laughs> 
Okay. Rudy's pretty strong. They're probably gonna do pretty well on these these um, low rank jobs. These guys believed they didn't believe him just because he had blue hair. Like what the heck? Have they ever never heard of hair coloring? Apparently not. Finding a lost cat. <laughs> uh oh, this guy realized it. This guy he really. <laughs> he's, down. Gonna, he's gonna keep his mouth shut yeah. though. I like that cloak that Eris is, is wearing. With the, with the, the ears, ears me too. Cat ears, that's pretty cool. I think it looks super cool on her. Oh, I get it. What? The blue hair, wouldn't that... um? Nah, I'm, I'm tripping. Ooh. Oh, oh, dang. She she says I'm flying. Dang. <laughs> Yo, because Rudy bought it. Eris is not playing around. <laughs> We're called dead end. Dance are laughing. Toku Rabu Tough. Okay. Uh oh, there goes that man god again. <laughs> yo, imagine a god just doing that though. <laughs> I'd be like, yo, what is this, man? Mm. Your worries will be at an end. Hmm. Okay. Is that the cat? That's a big cat. It's like a like a panther. Okay, and they got them. <laughs> kind of like a team just now. Damn. He kicked the heck out of Rudus. And Eris probably took them out. <laughs> Eris probably just took him out. Yo. Who did that? Was it Eris or was it? No, it was him that did that. Yeah, I don't think it was oh, her. Oh, man. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Yo, Aerospiel, she be, she be um, coming to Ruta's defense, man. She's always taking up for him. Mm -hmm. Hmm. 
We're going to trade jobs. One thing I got, let me, let's make sure there's nothing back here. Um, this anime is not, not too bad. It's, uh, you know, obviously after episode eight, um, I'm, everybody wanted to see episode eight for reasons. Um, but overall, um, it does seem like that we, we kind of transitioned to a different arc here. Cause the first few episodes were like an arc, like Rudis was, you know, getting on his feet training training being this new world and it's now it's like more of a, a new arc here they're like in this demon realm and like they're trying to make a name for themselves and try and get back home but these these two episodes were, were okay they were they were cool you know the story's developing and everything but um what i do notice here you know obviously rudy um you know rudis has this thing about him where he you know he has these characteristics they're not great good characteristic like he's a pervert he's a, you know he can be um you know he could be a perv he could be a creep he has these creepy behaviors but besides the, like these little instances because you know i think we had one like in like episode five maybe or four and then we had one in episode eight right and obviously learning about rudis backstory how you know he was a creep and like he was I think he was watching a video of his of a younger cousin or something on the laptop. It was some creepy stuff. But um besides these little instances, there's a real anime. There's a real story here. There's a real anime. And the character that is Rudis, you know, he's like like you know, he's doing some good. He's he's telling he's telling um what's his name? He has um what's the guy with Rujed? Rujed like yeah. man, it's hard to pronounce, but he's telling that he's telling him not to kill. He's trying to better his reputation and everything. Like, it doesn't seem like Rudis is a bad per. He's not like a bad person. He just has creepy behaviors that obviously he needs to address, right? But um, yeah, that's that's kind of what I'm seeing here because it it does seem like I, I wonder why you know I guess it's for shock value, mm -hmm. you know I think it's for shock value to like get people's attention, get people to talk about a series, and get mm -hmm. the series to have more eyes on it mm -hmm. you know people like oh what's this thing that people are talking about this weird thing let me go see what it's about you know mm -hmm. obviously it's super creepy and super weird and he has you know these characteristics but besides that rudis doesn't seem like overall like he's like a he's he doesn't seem like a bad person like a bad like a bad guy you know mm -hmm. what you think what bad guy would be he just seems to have like these creepy tendencies right um and i guess it is for shock value but um i still don't I wholeheartedly don't agree with any of that, you know, and um, ho hopefully he gets better as this anime progresses. But like, these two episodes are pretty cool. You know, we went from episode eight to that to like not even seen, you know, really anything of that. These these last two episodes. So I think it was pretty cool. Yeah. Um, since we jumped in the middle of season one, like back into Mushiko, mm -hmm. I wasn't really expecting too much because it's not like we're starting from episode one. It's like we're kind of like in the middle so i feel like these two episodes were kind of like slow pace introducing us to like you said maybe a new arc what well, um, is a new arc yeah you know introducing us to a new arc so it was it was good i want to see where season one goes i want to see like what other people see um because like you said in the beginning of this video so many people enjoy this anime and Correct. i and i want to see like that you know i want to see that great anime that everyone's talking about yeah like that that is one of the reasons i came back to this because like it does seem like so many people love this anime and love this story and i'm like mm -hmm. wow that's you know that's pretty interesting that so many people love this story and i guess besides because i do i kind of see it now besides these little tendencies and these one-off one-off things that um rudy does um 
I think it I think it is um he is different from other main characters to where you know usually it's like a another character that's kind of, kind of creepy like that and then mm-hmm. show like a, a antagonist would be a creep whatever and then like you know the protagonist beats the creep but this time around it is the protagonist that has the creepy tendencies but he's really not a bad person he's just trying to you know it's just it's a it's a weird thing to 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 to, to watch and think about but Overall, it's an anime, right? I'm not really going to think too big into it. Um, I'm not going to think, think too deep into it. It is an anime. And, um, you know, it's it's an enjoyable anime. It's like, you know, it's progressing. There's like some world developments here. There's like world built, like you know, there's different aspect to the world. And I think that's one of the things that, that makes it, that people like about it too. It's like, they're not only, you know, in one place. There's different, like, like they're in a demon realm right now. Like maybe there's different realms. And I know when we were watching, like last year or the year before that like they were talking about different you know worlds in the sky or whatever and like these heroes and stuff like that there's a lot of good things that could be um you know that this anime could have to offer and i think those are the things that people really really enjoy and you know i just wanted to out we 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 wanted to like you know give it another chance and see you know what the hype's about and give it and see what exactly um people enjoy about this anime and um We'll see, because um, I did hear that, um, you know, if we're going to jump back into it, you know, there, there are going to be <laughs> other instances of mm. these things. Because I have heard that through the grapevine that people have said that this is not the last time you'll see Rudy do some sketchy stuff. But <sighs> we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see where that goes. But overall, first two episodes back, I think it was cool. And uh, I think season two is actually currently on right now. Which yeah, is I think one that's the, what you said. Which yesterday. is one of the reasons I really wanted to check it out. I'm gonna, you know what? Season two is coming out um let's give this another chance to see what the hype's about and um and we'll see but hopefully you guys enjoyed the reaction Don't forget to like share and subscribe follow us on instagram and on twitter link will be in the description below definitely guys see you guys later. us out